Okay, first, this is a quick little video on what I uh, found as a way to copy folders in Google Drive. Uh, I've been talking to some uh, colleagues on Twitter and found that uh, when you go to Google Drive, you are uh, no longer able to copy folders uh, for some reason. So if I go to my Google Drive here and, and let's say I wanted to uh, copy this folder, when I right click on it, there is no copy folder option here anymore. So I um, was wondering if there was some kind of uh, extension or anything like that where I could uh, install that to as a way to copy folders. And I found one, and this is how you find it. So you just go to, I go to my apps here, and then... Um, down here, there's this little button where it says "Go." you go to the Google Web Store, click on that. And then all I did was typed in copy folder just to kind of see what would come up. And this is the one I found right here that I, I find that works really well. So it's called copy folder. And it actually gives you different... Um, options here that you could add to your Chrome uh, and things like that. But this is the one I found that works really well for me. And it's pretty simple. So I clicked on it. Okay. And obviously click on visit website. And it's, it's a script that it installs into your Google folder. So, and once you get it installed, this is um, how it works. So for instance, it says copy a Google Drive folder and all its contents. So the only thing is, and this is where you got to kind of make up your own decision here, is, is it actually has access to your folders in order for you to copy it. So that's a, a decision that you have to make, things like that. So I just click my selected folder button here. And as I said, you have to give it uh, access to your Google Drive. Okay, and again, that's some people, I mean, when it comes to privacy issues and things like that, maybe, maybe they don't want to do that, things of that nature. So, anywho, um, so let's say I go to a folder here. And let's say I wanted to copy this folder, my weekly lessons folder. So I have folders within that. And let's say I wanted to copy my lesson plans from... Uh, two years ago, from 2015 to 2016. So I right-click on that, I click on it, go to select, okay, and then it says, it gives you a, a copy, folder and a copy of 2015. Again, you can change it to whatever you would like, okay? You can copy the sharing permissions. For instance, if you don't want it to, you can. If you want it to be yes, whereas, like, I keep these private just for myself, Okay, you click yes there. Um, this option here, copy folder, same resource folder. So that means that it would put it in my same folder that I have right now in my own Google Drive. Or, as it gives you the notification here, root directory. You can put it right at the top of your My Drive. But just for this demo, I'm going to keep it in the same source folder. And then all you got to do here is click copy folder. And then after this, it says initialize, initializing your uh, copy request. Okay, and again, um, and here it goes. It has begun to copy your folder and things like that. Now, the only kicker with this is that the amount of content you have in each folder, it may take a little while longer for you to get all the contents copied. Um, and also you would want to keep this in the background so I can make this its own window here. Okay. And I can just minimize this. Okay. Make it its own tab here and minimize this. And now I can go on and work on other things, okay, while it's um, 
still going and copying my folder and my contents right now. So you'll want to leave that in the background. If you go to your drive here, you can kind of see if it's working. So if I go to my drive, go to where I keep my lessons. And here's a folder right there that it is copying as of right now. Okay, so here was the original folder, 2015, 2016. Now it's copying all the contents out of that folder into this new one right here. So as I said, that's a, it's a little add-on that I found on Chrome as a way of copying folders into Google Drive. Um, again, an issue with the privacy because it gives access to your Google Drive. But again, that's a call that you have to make. But um, um, that's the one that I found that works best for me. And as I said, it keeps copying in the background as you are able to do other things and work on your computer for other things. So uh, quick little tutorial there. I hope it helps. Uh, I will put this on my YouTube channel and uh, we'll also post it on Twitter. Thanks.